जैन जैन ट्वेंटी सो जैन टू थाउजेंड एटीन एस वेल एस जैन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी सो द क्वेश्चन इज लाइक दिस कैलकुलेट Calculate zenith angle zenith angle of the sun of the sun at Lucknow at Lucknow. The angle is given at the left now. The the latitudinal angle is given twenty six point seven five twenty six point degree north. So this is the angle at the time is also given. That is nine thirty a.m. A time is also given. That is nine thirty a.m. and the date is also given on Feb sixteen two thousand fourteen. So this was a question given. So we are supposed to determine your zenith angle. That is theta z. So just I will explain how can the things be determined here. So you need to remember few formulas here uh, because there is no any derivation for that formula. So you have to remember that. Okay. So first for the solution, the total number of days I need to count here. It is given that Feb 16. So uh, I will write the formula first. Then we will understand what I need to determine. So the formula for determining That is theta z. So that is cos theta z, z is given. So from that I can determine theta z. Cos theta z is equal to cos of phi into cos of del cos of del into cos of omega, or I can say w. Cos of W plus sine phi sine phi into into sine del. I have to remember this formula. So this is where we can determine the azimuth angle theta z. Theta z is nothing but my azimuth angle. So before that, we should understand what is phi, what is del, and what is W. These are the unknowns here. Just I will underline. Phi for this formula, phi del and w. So once again, the phi and del are repeating here. Okay, I need to find phi, del and w. So here, so first I will write a formula for del now. I will take the black color itself. Del. So del that is nothing but my uh, declination angle, which to say that is equal to that is equal to once again the formula for this is. Twenty three point four five, twenty three point four five into sine into sine three sixty into sine three sixty into into two eighty four plus small n. Here n is a number of days which we need to calculate here into Whole divided by 365. So this is the formula for del. So first, in this formula, 
the n is unknown other things can be easily determined right so only n is unknown to determine my del so here how to calculate the n from the given problem so here the total number of days n is nothing but the total number of days here total number of days we need to count from because the problem in the problem it is given from the feb 16 so but the date will start or day will start from the jan 1st of the same year total number of days counted so to remember this how to determine the n from jan 1st jan 1st of the same year in the problem it is given as a 2014 till where should i count till the problem in the problem it is given as till feb 16 feb 16 2014 so if you calculate if you calculate number of days from the jan to feb so how many days it will, it will be from jan almost all say 31 days then feb 16 if you add you will get n equal to so number of days we need to count from the jan first to till feb 16 so number of days will be equal to 47 so this is how we need to determine here so this is my n so this is my n okay so next i will determine now del i will substitute n in the above formula so therefore if i calculate my del substituting n in the above formula i will get as minus 12.95 degree on approximate day i can round up to minus 13 degree so this is the angle of a del so now one thing is done so this is done okay i will just mark the other color no del is done so next phi phi is actually it is given in the problem that is my 26.75 degree the attitude angle which is given so this itself is a phi so this is a phi which is given in the problem so phi is also known del is also known so next we need to find the w that is nothing but my hover angle so next we will find that hover angle hover angle w that is equal to the formula for this is 1 by 4 into tm 1 by 4 into tm so tm is where I need to determine tm here where tm is nothing but so it's related to time time so in the problem it is given as how much it is given it is given as 9 30 am it is given as 9 30 am so i'll go back there so when you calculate tm we will take reference time as a total known we will take as a total known minus i will do 9 30 minus 9 30 12 minus 9 30 if i do that the difference will be almost 150 one and a half uh, how i can say sorry two and a half hour 150 minutes so it will be tm will be in terms of minutes so this is my tm so now if i carry substitute in the w w is equal to 1 by 4 into 150 so then i will get the angle as the hover angle w as 37.5 degrees try to calculate this have a practice of uh, remembering the formulas and how to determine uh, n in the uh, given problem how to determine w from the given problem just remember these things okay so this is the w now here one thing we need to remember once you calculate the w so there is a condition if the time which is given the problem if it is before 12 noon 
if the time is given before 12 noon then i need to take this w with a negative sign okay the hour angle should be taken with a negative sign if the given time the problem so if this is after 12 noon say after 12 o'clock noon okay if that is a case we will take it as a positive if it is before 12 noon we will take negative now that is 9:30 am it is before 12 noon so hence i will take this w as a minus sign so just i will write here since since time is before solar noon solar noon hence hence negative sign will be taken will be taken so therefore W is equal to minus thirty seven point five degree. Okay, getting right. Why I am taking this one minus thirty seven point five degree. Okay, before because it is before turn noon. So now all the unknowns are determined here. So this is also known known. So W is also known. So now I can substitute that values in that. The cost data set. Then I can determine the. <coughs> just to write that formula once again. Azimuth, uh, sorry, is there uh, zenith angle? Zenith angle. Zenith angle. Cos. Theta z is equal to cos of phi. Phi I will substitute the value here. Twenty six point seven phi into cos of into cos of omega. Omega is given as minus omega. I can take it as a sorry. It's not omega. It's a del minus thirteen degree. Into cos of W, that is minus thirty seven point five minus thirty seven point five plus plus sine phi. Once again, the phi value is twenty six point seven five, which is given in the problem directly. That is the latitudinal angle. Then into sine into sine del. So del is once again minus thirteen degree. So if we calculate this, we will get the answer as there is cos theta z is equal to point five eight nine point five eight nine. From this. Theta z is equal to theta z is equal to cos inverse of 0.589. That will be equal to 53.914 degree. So this is the value which is supposed to determine for a given problem.